Hi there! I'm playing with some stuff again. This time stuff I made myself. Yes, I'm talking about this dummy head here and you are currently, currently listening to my voice through the ears of this head. So it's a dummy head microphone. And to demonstrate you right away what a dummy head microphone does, let's turn it. Now you hear my voice in front of you. And if I turn that head around, you suddenly hear my voice coming from behind. But you only can hear that if you use headphones. It doesn't work with uh, standard speakers. You have to use headphones because the speakers are always in front of you and you cannot hear the difference. So, what is a dummy head microphone for those who have never heard about it? Well, it's basically a dummy head with artificial ears. And inside the ears there is a microphone. Maybe we can see that hole a little bit closer. Yes, there is the microphone inside and there is the cable coming out on the back here. Okay, let's turn it back and I'm talking again in front of you. So the effect of a dummy head microphone is you only have two channels, left and right, but because the sound enters through a natural formed ear, you can also uh, distinguish between sound coming from above or below you or behind you or in front of you. So in fact you don't only have left or right, you have a full 3D sound uh, stage. And I have prepared some recordings outside the house and maybe you want to enjoy that. And again, it only works with headphones, obviously. Um, before I show you the clips I made, I want to explain how I made this head. So it's a massive head made of wood. So uh, it's made from about five millimeter thick uh, pieces of plywood that I cut in shape roughly on my bandsaw, glued everything together and that's not the big problem. You can take whatever you want for that head. It just can't be hollow. It must be some solid material because it has to dampen the sound from one side to the other side. The problem is how to get these ears. So I spent quite a while <clears throat> to find ears that fit here and I was already in the progress of making a, a, a copy of my own ear with silicone and stuff like that and then I found these ears in, uh, in a medical supply shop. They are used for um, that uh, therapy with needles, how is it called? Ah oh, yes, acupuncture. And these uh, silicon ears, you can see they are soft like real ears, they are used to practice and uh, they are, yes, it seems you have to practice that a little bit before you use it on a real human. And you can also find these ears in uh, shops for uh, piercings to practice piercing. So they can use this rubber ears here to practice whatever they have to. So they are perfect. They are made of soft silicon. Almost feels like a real ear. They have all the roundings and all the valleys and gaps here like a real ear. And 
therefore it works like a real ear and also this 3d effect comes out pretty good i would say okay let's watch the clips <laughs> 